and welcome to today's edition of Top Rated Recruiter Spotlight. My name is Adam Conrad. I'm the founder and CXO of Great Recruiters, and I am joined here today with one of our Q2 2024 Top Rated Recruiters, Lynette Kahui. Lynette, how are you doing today? Doing great. Thank you, Adam. So happy to be here. Well, let me tell you, the only thing more fun than pronouncing your last name, which is a blast, is reading your bio. And I I love the first line, rock star talent whisperer with Thank over you. two decades of world hopping industry jumping expertise. I've mastered the art and crafting of unstoppable success stories, uh, which is amazing. Uh, I you. read that and then I read the reviews and Lynette has a 4.95 star rating. 72 reviews, 97% highly recommend Lynette. Let me tell you, there's a reason for that. Uh, and I'll give you a little bit of glimpse of what one person had to say, because I thought this was just absolutely perfect. Lynette is an outstanding recruiter whose skills and dedication set her apart in the field. She excels at ensuring both candidates and companies find the perfect match. Her exceptional ability to connect with candidates on a personal level combined with her in-depth knowledge of the industry tends, trends, makes her highly effective. Uh, yes. Drop the mic, Lynette. You're doing a great job. Thank you. Thank you. I really owe oh, those, those reviews are, are great. My candidate relationships are phenomenal. And I tell each of them, whenever they leave a review, I, I, I'm just taken back by it. And I appreciate each and every one of them for doing that. So thank you. Well, yeah. And you, you earned it. Obviously you're providing the kind of experience that would elicit this type of response. Uh, before we really jump into it, uh, uh, tell us a little bit about yourself. Okay, great. Yes, I've been in recruiting for, as as my bio says, um, over two decades, and uh, you know, kind of really fell into it. That's the best way I would like to describe it. Because out of college, you know, I got my under uh, undergrad in marketing management, and I was a marketing administrator at a sport company, um, and one of the HR uh, managers wanted and needed help in recruiting. And I was like, you know, 20, nothing when that, when uh, she approached me and I thought, all right, this sounds cool. Why not? And literally was, you know, in the back doing sourcing, you know, back then um, pretty much what source our talent sourcers do. Yeah. And the thing I love so much about it was that relationships, that the relationship that you build with candidates and truly from that point forward, um, I have always loved recruiting. I, 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 I've dabbled in, uh, and been in HR and, um, and, you know, total rewards, benefits and comp, but recruiting has always been, um, the highlight for me. And so for about 20 so years, I've been in recruiting, but specifically technical recruiting. And I just love it. I, I'm very passionate about what I do. Um, I love getting up every day to do it. It's my motivator. And, and like I tell everybody that asks me, you know, what do you do? And do you like what you do? I love what I do. And I think that's important, especially for me at this point in my life, being in a, a type of role where I can do what I do. And uh, yeah, so that's a that's little awesome. bit about me as far as my recruiting background and, and why I, I do what I do every day. I, just I love it. it. I love it. Well, you knocked out the first three questions, so we're good to go there. <laughs> okay. um, hey, unpack a little bit. Uh, IT is a very wide uh, industry. Talk a little bit about where, where do you really hone in and where is your skills and expertise and types of people that you help most often? Sure. Um, you're right. I mean, we a lot of it is, uh, you know, a mostly, if not all, IT technical related, but cybersecurity roles, architect roles, developer, you know, anything from our full stack to .NET developers um, and engineers. That's pretty much where uh, I hone in on, you know, a lot of my strengths are there. I find a lot of candidates have a pretty large pipeline of candidates that are not only here in the Atlanta area, but all over um, with those skill set. And so I, I would say probably in the cybersecurity architect and developer and engineers, that's where... Okay. And, and yeah. you're based you're based in Atlanta now. Are you uh, just recruiting locally in Atlanta? Are you looking regional, nationwide? It it varies from client to client uh, because we have had roles that were nationwide, but primarily in the southeast, um, Atlanta, uh, southeast, and sometimes northeast regions. But we 
our whole team at tier four group, um, we cover the whole nation. Uh, and so it depends on the client where the need is. If it's fully remote, then it doesn't really matter where uh, the individual sits. But I would say the majority of the roles I work on are, are Southeast, Southeast. Okay. Mm-hmm. Now, I'm really interested in this. How is, is somebody with tenure in this industry, you've been there, you've done that, you, 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 you obviously care about people and relationships. How, how has Great Recruiters helped you? Well, I will say in the, the, the time that I've been, you know, uh, I guess I would say a veteran in my field, I've never had a platform like Great Recruiters that really not only reviewed recruiters, but helped give us the feedback that we get directly from our candidate experience, which I think is critical. Um, I, I, I enjoy all the reviews that I get, but I've never had a platform where it was utilized like this. And so I guess the thing that has helped me the most is really getting that feedback and to hear um, back from the candidate, you know, about the candidate experience and and how I am helping them and and what they really, truly like about me as a recruiter. You know, it, it kind of solidifies what I do and am I doing it well? Am I doing it right? Because, you know, w- when we get these reviews, it's not like we're saying, give us a, you know, five, we, we, they just you know, they, they'll give us a review. It could be good or bad. And I am, am happy to say I haven't received anything. I mean, they're just glowing reviews. And so for me, what I will say, great recruiters is great because I've never had a platform where candidates can provide that feedback on yeah. what we do as recruiters and how we are um, meeting their goal, which is to not only place them in an ideal role, but, you know, provide that really great candidate experience. And and so that's what I really like about it. Every time I get a review, it's kind of exciting because I'll read it and I'll think, wow, that's really nice of them to say that about me. It's, you know, it's always a pleasure. It's it's a tough, it's a tough business and you get a lot of at bats and, you know, we don't always get a hit when we're up at the plate. Uh, I'm a, I coach baseball, so too many baseball analogies, but, but it reminds me a lot of recruiting. I mean, you talk to a lot of folks, you can't help everybody. I always say you can't promise to place everybody, but you can promise to create a great experience and you start planting those seeds, nurturing those relationships. And I imagine you experience as well over time, it does get easier because you have a network of people who trust you, who believe in you, who know the type of recruiter you are, that they call you back. True. I wouldn't say it's easy. I mean, being a recruiter, uh, it's tough. And I was just, you know, speaking to somebody earlier about this, um, who also is a recru- actually Lexi, who, um, you know, is a great recruiter. And it's, it's not something that I would say for everybody. You really have to Um, not take things personally. Um, There's a lot of, you know, in in the type of work that we do, you know, have to be, uh, you know, sometimes the bearer of bad news. If you've got a candidate that you really thought was going to be placeable and for whatever reason, the client or the company is going with another candidate, you know, it's that, that, that um, not having, you know, not taking things personally, you know, uh, being there, being the advocate for the candidate is important and also, you know, helping the client. But when things don't necessarily go the way we would expect it to go, you have to still get up the next day and move and push forward. And and that's one thing um, about being a recruiter. I wouldn't say it's easy. It's great that when you have a really good pipeline of candidates, you can go and fall right. back and then, um, you know, you could reconnect with, but uh, it's definitely something that I enjoy doing because at the end of the day, if I can meet someone's goal, whether it's the client or the candidate, then, uh, you know, I feel like I, I've, I'm fulfilled, you know, I, I, yeah. I've done what I was supposed to do as, as a recruiter. Oh, that's great. And what is being named top rated recruiter? What does that mean to you? You know, it's humbling, um, honestly, to, to hear what, you know, that's, it's because there are so many, really good recruiters, especially here at tier four. I mean, I, um, we've got some strong recruiters on the team. And so, you know, it, it's a, it's, it's a really kind of nice, uh, nice thing to, to know that you're a top rated recruiter. And again, I would, I would say I attribute a lot of that to my candidates because I wouldn't be if it wasn't for my candidates and for the feedback that they provided and for the relationship that we've built, which is trust and, um, 
you know, that's one of the reasons why I love what I do is building that relationship with candidate yeah. and client. And, you know, I call myself a talent matchmaker. You know, I'm here to match talent with the clients and and, and hopefully have a successful union. And uh, so to be the top rated or, you know, one of the great recruiters or certified great recruiter is it's it's just, you know, it's nice to know. But it's very, also very you know humbling to know that that uh, I've been rated that way. Because well. There's a lot of great recruiters that are in the team. There are, and and you don't give yourself enough credit because although the candidates provided those reviews, uh, they provided them because of the exceptional experience that you provided. And you. <laughs> your rating is so high because of the exceptional work that you do. Uh, and so don't cut yourself short. Uh, the Thank candidates might have provided the feedback, but they wouldn't have if they didn't absolutely love the work that they're doing. Uh, Thank you. I appreciate them. that. <laughs> um, so to, to wrap, uh, talk to us a little bit. What I'm a new candidate. I, I reach out. You connect with me. What type of experience can I uh, expect working with you? Yeah, no, I think it's great. Um, good question. And we get asked this a lot. Uh, you know, what can uh, what's the benefits of working with a recruiter? And I, what I would say is, you know, I offer transparency, um, which I think helps build that trust with the candidate. I, I initially build a really good trust relationship foundation with the candidate so that I can represent them. I can be the advocate for them. Um, you know, I can go to bat for them. Uh, you know, that's what, what I think is so great about working with a, a recruiter, because not only do we represent them, but we have a direct line to that hiring manager at the client. And instead of, let's say a candidate going into like a queue where they're just waiting for somebody internally at that company to reach out to them, you know, we can provide, I can provide, that experience for them where I can, you know, give effective communication. I coach. I'm also a career coach. So if they're about to go to an interview, I can coach them on, right, here are some of the things that I've seen um, an individual be successful in with this role and, you know, that kind of thing or any tips that I can provide. And then even in, in closing. So I provide that full uh, candidate experience and recruiting life cycle with the candidate to the client and hopefully get them a, ro a role or a job that, you know, they really want. Uh, and so that's one of the reasons, again, I love being a recruiter. And if a candidate were to approach me with that, uh, I'm, I'm here to help. I'm here to, to match them to the right role and get them placed at the right company. Well, I'll tell you what, if you're in the IT industry and you're looking for a recruiter to work with, uh, whether or not the, the role is open or not, I got to say that Lynette and the folks at Tier 4 are definitely a company you need to work out, uh, reach out to and, and work with. Uh, the commitment that they have to providing that exceptional quality, to providing that experience, they understand that this is not a transactional type business. It's a relationship-based business. Uh, and you just... Absolutely. see it and feel it having this conversation reading the reviews so uh i just want to congratulate you again on being named top rated for q2 2024 thank lynette uh, thank keep you. up the great work uh the team's lucky to have uh to have you and candidates are lucky to know who you are and so if you're looking for a recruiter uh in the it world look no further than lynette and the team over at tier four group so, uh, thank you so i wish much. you all the best yes my pleasure thanks